Good morning, and on this video, we're going to talk about our daily routines that help us win the day. What are we doing to set ourselves up for success every single day? Welcome to the Do You Live channel. I'm Jeff, and on a normal basis, we talk about all things marketing, digital, design, interactive, and do your lives daily. Wednesday's my day, and I thought I would just start to spin it up from the bottom up. What do we do on a consistent basis every day to win the day? And this is a great community that we're forming, and we're stronger if we share, and we're stronger if we drive engagement, and we're stronger if we actually um, you know, open up and expose parts of our lives that we may not see behind the scenes, or we may not see out in public, but this is more of a behind the scenes view. So I decided to take a bold step, and I sat here and debated this morning do I go live? At, it's 5.30 right now. I'm in my basement. Uh, family's upstairs sleeping. And I was hesitant to do it, but that was the signal that I should do it. Because anytime you're a little nervous or you're a little hesitant, that means you're making the right decision because that's what's going to break through. So together, we're starting our day off together. We're going to win this day together. And I want to know what you are doing to win the day every day. So let's cruise down the hall real quick. I want to um, gonna leave here. Excuse me if this is a little troubling. All right, so here we are in my basement office. My morning routine is this, and I would love everyone to share their morning routine. So the morning routine, jump out of bed around five after a snooze, First thing I do is beeline it to the coffee, and I drink yesterday's coffee this morning, so I just need that little jolt. So I drink yesterday's coffee, at least a cup, of maybe a cup and a half, come down to the basement, and a big part of the morning routine is just jumping on the elliptical and working out, and not even, sometimes you don't even break that sweat, but it's more or less just to get the energy flowing. But I have a couple resources I've used to help structure my morning routine to get me going. And I'm sure you've heard of them, but let's see. Oh yeah, here's one. So one is the five minute journal. And that's, this is last year's. And I have to say, I'm not as consistent as I should be in filling out the five minute journal, but I do recommend it. It's a great way to, um, just commit to setting yourself up for some goals, goals for the day. What are you grateful for? The small things that you're grateful for. And it allows you to really focus your efforts and focus your energy and just focus on the right things on a consistent basis and appreciate what we have. So I would recommend a five-minute journal. I have an extra one if you need one. I want to check it out. And then another book, which has been interesting, The Miracle Morning, Hal Elrod. So this is a book. It's a big personal, you know, he's deep into the school of personal development, really good guy. But the Miracle Morning, uh, it's all about winning the day. And he, have a, he has a SAVERS model. And it's an acronym for silence. Um, basically, he runs through the cycle of all the ways on a consistent basis through a morning routine. And this routine could take anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. Some people do it in five minutes. But it's just a consistent routine every single day that sets you up for success. And the more that you can, I would have to say, automate or make consistent in your life, things like wearing the same outfit, the more you can just basically be consistent every day and make fewer choices in the morning, for example, when you're getting out the door, getting ready to work, the more you can save that mental bandwidth for, for your creative energy. So these are a couple guides, um, good books to read to kind of set yourself up for a morning routine. I'm about to hit, go into my little home gym and hit the elliptical. And typically I listen to a podcast or watch a video, of maybe some Gary V. Just kind of cruise through, see what's going on, try to learn something in the morning. Post podcast, I hit the floor, you know, work on the back, right? And normally that's, then I head back to the, head back into my office and my whiteboard. That moment, like that, I look forward to that part of my day every day because I'm usually gets thinking about something, I'm inspired by something that I read or I watched, 
and I hit the whiteboard, and my whiteboard is a chaotic mess. Here, let me show you real quick. See, it's just lots of lots of stuff. Like that. Um, but without my morning routine and without going through that cycle of working out, I wouldn't have a lot of the ideas that I have, and seventy percent of them are just basically ideas, and they just kind of go into the filter, if you will. But but uh, a lot of the decisions I've made are on focus areas, direction, ways to develop the business are made in this pocket between post-workout before shower because I have uh, feel inspired and energetic. So the morning routine continues. I take a shower, head upstairs, and by that point, my kids are up and, you know, do that routine, right? Make lunches, get them out the door. Um, my wife is there already going after it. Um, getting them out the door. So, and then as soon as you get out the door, by eight o'clock, it's in the seat and head over to work, head over to the office or the client site for the day, and then take it from there. So, love to know what is your morning routine? Do you have a morning routine? Have you tried a morning routine? And has it helped you win the day? This is a community. We're working together to build a community, not only how we improve our marketing and design chops, but also how we improve our lives. And uh, I encourage you to always be bold and do things you shouldn't, you don't think you should do because that's what makes life most fun. So please comment below if you would um, have anything to add to the community or just want to, you know, support and inspire each other. Please do that. So I hope you have a great day and win this day today and every day. Thank you.